199 X-ray here. We're uh, leaving. Me and my boy Greg right here is on a ZX10. We are leaving on our big trip, Operation West Coast. I think is what I'm going to call it. And uh, we're leaving Tulsa right now on US 75 South, heading towards Dallas, then San Antonio, going to San Antonio, and then from there. Then from San Antonio, we'll hop on I-10 to Tucson and then Phoenix, and that will be the Bun Burner ride done. Welcome to Texas, baby. Hell yeah. Just got a slap on the wrist. <laughs> He just said slow down. Right. No tickets or anything, so we're good. All right. So we're in Dallas, Texas. We're riding, we're cruising, we're making pretty good time at a free gas stop. So we're probably gonna stop here pretty soon, maybe a little past this. And I can grab something to eat. Kind of hungry. So uh, we're doing good. Trip's going good. No problem so far. Got pulled over once. No big deal. Greg, how are you feeling, buddy? Pretty good, man. I'm ready. How do you feel about the first iron butt? So fast. <laughs> no, it's pretty cool, man. It's ready for the last run. Hell yeah. We we're just out of gas station. Uh, getting some gas, obviously. And we, while we were getting gas, we met a, one of those, one of those guys that you, you meet and you remember for the rest of your life. And I just want to give this out here while it's fresh. Uh, I, I don't recall his name, but I got a, I have a picture of him. Uh, little Honda Rebel. Uh, guys rode all over the country with this dog. Uh, really friendly, well-trained dog. That gets on and off the bike by itself, you know, the whole nine yards. Uh, the guy, uh, I assume, is, is homeless. Uh, I bought him some gas. I filled up his bike with gas and gave him some cash. Uh, but just a really nice guy and just really passionate about riding. Uh, been all over the United States with the dog. I, val I valued that interaction a lot. It was it was like talking to somebody real. Uh, I don't know if that makes sense to anybody, but it's like talking to somebody real. All right, so Greg ran out of gas. We're in the middle of the freaking desert. There's no absolutely no gas stations out here. Everybody's stopping at this gas station to buy gas cans and gas for other people who have run out of gas. So, we're going to bring this back to Greg. I'm talking about, we have not seen a gas station in 150 miles at least. I barely, barely made it there. I probably had 15 miles left in my tank when I made it to the little rinky dink gas station that's almost completely out of gas. Jesus Christ, man, what a mess. <laughs> oh my God, been laughing for like a minute. We uh, almost had a redo of what we had in the desert. Greg here is running on fumes and uh, <laughs> he should have seen his reaction when he freaking saw the sign for the shell station, man. He freaking threw his arms up like, yeah. We barely made it, dude. This sucks. There's a minuscule amount of gas stations out here. We're still in Texas. We're uh, approaching El Paso. We're probably 60 to 90 miles away from El Paso. So why are you always trying to run out of gas? I'm not, man. <laughs> this is thirsty. I thought I was gonna, <laughs> I thought I was gonna have to get you gas again. I was like, F here we go. go. 
Like, I didn't, I, I didn't see a sun for a minute now, and finally seen that sun, I was like, thank God. I saw you go throw your arms up, I laughed so hard. Alright, well, we, Greg and I are in El Paso on I-10 West. We're finally out of the f***ing desert. Holy s***. Uh, but we're having a nice view over here of the city. And it's actually, I've heard terror, I heard a lot of bad things about El Paso. People are saying what a rough town it is and everything. This is like any other major city. They got lots of, it's actually pretty nice, in my opinion. Good morning, Arizona. Holy crap, we just got done getting our gas receipts. Iron butt was completed, the bun burner with 30 minutes to spare. Uh, we did a bunch of goofing around and it took extra long breaks and everything. But we took up like the full time. But we got her done, got all our receipts and everything, so mission accomplished. I we been we were rained on like five times and then every time we stopped to put rain gear on ahead of time it didn't rain just i mean greg ran out of gas but you already know about that this was the most hardest earned bun burner i think that the iron buzz association will ever have to do we stuck this out i'm talking about God, it was, I mean, we have, we have some stories, we have some stories from this one, but we freaking conquered it all, and uh, freaking got it done with 30 minutes to spare, that is beautiful. We're going over to AZ Wacko's house right now, and we're gonna crash.